stars. I've decided to sell my 1914 Hillrick and Bradley putter. I'm asking 700. They've been playing this game or a version of it forever. In Scotland, it got so bad, they actually outlawed it on Sundays because the church was actually concerned that so many guys were playing golf uh -huh. that they weren't going to church. What do you want for it? 700. Here you go. <laughs> I'll give you 400. 600. <laughs> golf is just not as big as other sports. With the connection to the Hillary and Bradsby company, it's much more collectible. 500 bucks. I'm gonna have to get a frame, I'm gonna have to get it, some golf pictures in it. Okay, 550. 500 bucks. I'm gonna pay you money, and then I'm gonna have other money. I'm gonna have labor. All right. Okay. All right, man. Brought two hand drawn World War II maps and one that is printed. I would like to get $14,000. The invasion of Normandy or D Day was the largest amphibious invasion of a country that anybody's ever done. Eisenhower actually carried a note in his pocket on D-Day that said, if this fails, it's my fault. Let me call a friend of mine up that can kind of help me out. Hey, Mark, I need to know what exactly I'm looking at. These are actually preliminary maps for a publication that came out at the end of the war. It was a map book that was done in 1945 showing where exactly the 15th Corps went. This is basically a sketch that then became the map that was published. So this is basically printer's waste, something that would have been thrown away. I'm just going to find a private collector that I might be more interested. Well, I came to the pawn shop to sell this Roman coin that I have that I found in my family's collection. That's uh, Caligula. He married his sister, made a horse a senator. He ordered thousands and thousands of statues all over Rome for the heads to be lopped off and have a new head put on, which With was his head. head. Does this look you know, legit to you? I see these so rarely. And I'm gonna get my buddy down here. I'm gonna have him look at it. If it is real, we could be talking a lot of money. If it's real. If it's real. I called in David to sort it out. This is a silver denarius. The history and everything on the coin is great. Right. Is it real? Absolutely genuine. What's it worth? 10,000 plus. What are you willing to take for it? 10K. I'll give you seven grand. I just see my old pappy in heaven looking down at me going, boy, don't get rid of that for less than $9,000. I'll give you $8,500. And I won't give you a penny more. Happy says 9,000. 85 is what I could do. I just don't feel comfortable paying anymore. No, I understand. You know what? My pappy's been wrong before. Let's do 